uses that fear to take control of your city. She opposes every effort to replace Viscount Dumas. And you have seen the chaos of her reign. Will you allow it? Return to your homes. This farce is over. Wait! Perhaps there are some who might disagree with you, Knight Commander. Do not hide behind the champion. He has no role in this. It would be better if you both calmed down before this gets violent. I should remain calm while a mage provokes an uprising. I think not. I think the champion's views would be appreciated. Or do you fear what he has to say? I fear nothing. My only interest here is in keeping order and protecting the innocent. Your measures have become more extreme over the last three years. And you could do better? How well did you guard your own mother? Did she not die at a blood mage's hands? Leave my mother out of this. Cold corpses speak louder than abstract freedoms, do they not? As long as that's true, Kirkwall needs its Templars more than it needs a new ruler. And when will that end? When will you stop seeing evil in every corner? When it's no longer there. The first enchanter accused you of trying to take control of the city. The city? I am trying to keep order until there is a ruler capable of succeeding where Dumas failed. And if not, will the Templars rule Kirkwall forever? We will not stand idle while the city burns around us. The Templar Order exists to guard the Chantry and Circle. I suggest you let the nobility rule the city. I do not need you or anyone to tell me what my duty is, mage. If Kirkwall wants Meredith to step down, they'll tell her to. Are you mad? They fear her. Everyone fears her. No matter what, Knight Commander, he has a point. Face the truth, Knight Commander. You are done. That is for me to decide. No one else. My, my. Such a terrible commotion. This mage incites rebellion, Your Grace. I am dealing with the matter. Ah, Orsino. So frustrated. Do you think this is truly wise? I... No, Your Grace. Of course not. Young men, would you show the first enchanter back to the circle? Gently, if you please. Your Grace! He should be clapped in irons! Made an example of! That's enough, Meredith. This demeans us all. Surely you can see that. Go back to the gallows and calm down, like a good girl. You have my thanks for stepping in, champion. If you had not... You're the Grand Cleric. Aren't you in charge of the Templars and Circle? Oh, my. <laughs> You have quite the estimation of my abilities. Gentle people of Kirkwall, return to your homes, I implore you. This will not be solved today. And now I must attend to the gallows. They will see reason if the Maker wills it. Thank you again, champion.
All quiet around here, Captain. Good, carry on. So who is Bianca? Micro. Many Canari fell in Kirkwall when we departed. I am sent to gather their swords. If you find a Canari sword, return it to me. Don't you want their bodies too? Their husks serve no purpose. The weapons shall satisfy a demand of the Kuhn. What do I get if I bring one to you? It is reward enough to complete a worthy task. But if you crave gold, that can be arranged. I'll keep an eye out. You will find me here. Nice to see this place fixed up again. I hope there's no trouble from it. Now, things have been very troubling these last few years, haven't they? I, uh, I was thinking that it might soon be time for my boy and I to move on. Back to the merchant's life, I suppose. It's an honor to serve the champion of Kirkwall. Make no mistake, but I'm getting older. It's time to see the Sandal's future. I'll stay on until arrangements are made. I hope that's all right. If you're worried about Sandal, I can help him out. Oh, oh that's mighty kind of you, but it's unnecessary. My boy's been offered a position in Orlay. It seems the Empress herself found one of his enchantments and is intrigued. Can you imagine? Us in the Imperial Court.
Hopefully this business with the Templars doesn't get worse before we go. I worry about you, Miss Eyre. The old lady is scary. There is no old lady, Sandal. How many times do I have to tell you that? What's this about? Oh, my boy sees things sometimes. Says he saw an old lady standing by his bed. She has a scary laugh. Yes, well, there you go.